Hey, what's up guys, Lovejoy here and welcome back to another video. In today's video we're going to be trying out AMS2. Um, I think I've got maybe about an hour in the game so far. I uh, haven't really played it. Tried to boot it up today. Uh, all I had to set all the controls again and even that took an hour. That took an hour, literally an hour. Um, but everything's working now, I can finally use my shifters. Let's drive the new cars. We've got the GT3s and the GT4s, they've just been added about a week ago. They've also added the Nürburgring. GP circuit. All right, let's get on track. We're driving McLaren 720S. Starting at the back of the grid, 25 cars, I think, total. Five laps, Let's see what we can do. Got time sped up as well. Yeah. Alrighty then, here we are, McLaren 720S. I can actually hear myself talk now. And then let's go. All right, so I did a lap beforehand, couldn't hear myself talk at all, and then got killed by uh, everyone else. So I thought I'd uh, give it a quick restart. Means T1, it's always hectic. I've turned the uh, driver aggression down a little bit. It hasn't changed the fact that they still just want to ram me off the track. But, uh, oof, okay, I'm ramming them actually. So, anyway, like I said, uh, new cars, the GT3s. They also have added the uh, GT4s. Um, yeah, so they've also added the GT4s. I'll test those as well. Um, but this is more of just like a getting back into uh, AMS because I think I've played it for about an hour before. And uh, yeah, that's about it. I, I don't know if I really enjoyed it but wanted to save it for another video or, or what. I actually don't remember my opinions on it. <laughs> doing that through there but just going through the menus and trying to get this game to work for me <sighs> took way too long it took me about an hour to get this all working <laughs> um, getting at least to the point where I could uh, actually shift that was the big one the shifters weren't working so I had to reset all controls oh Jesus I'll go around the outside, don't mind if I do. Oh Jesus Christ! Good start. Flying through the middle. I don't want to car on my right hand side as we get into uh, T1, so I'm going to try and just murder everyone on the way in. Alright, there's a reason why I did that. The AI, I've got them on, I think, 30% aggression. They just don't... They act as though you're not there. Literally. Um, <laughs> which is... Which is fun. It's always nice when you have cars crashing into you non-stop. So if I go up on the inside here... I won't do it there. That's a bit of a stupid place to do it. So you let me left me room there, and apparently you just let me go, which is interesting. So I don't mind it a bit of defence. That was a bit of defending. That that blocked my line up into into the Schumacher S, which fair play. That is that is good racing. What I do mind is when they just don't think I'm there. <laughs> and just keep sideswiping me. Anyway, enough about talking to the AI just for a minute until they kill me in about five seconds time. Uh, let's talk about the actual game itself. Uh, the handling seems quite nice. Force feedback is amazing. I mean, I think AMS1, the force feedback, was really, really nice and responsive. Uh, this is the same. I mean, I think I did my video uh, a couple of months ago now where I was, I was playing AMS1 and I was just in love with the force feedback and the sounds and everything. And uh, this feels quite a lot of the same, which isn't a bad thing. Um, so there's that. Sorry, I just want to not... 
That was an absolute cock up on my behalf. Just didn't break. Oh! Yeah, I'm still here, bud. <laughs> like I said, the AI is just like uh, some of them at least. Usually the Porsches. <laughs> I mean, that was all on me. I kept my foot in. <laughs> <laughs> So what I found with GT3s is there isn't a touch, it's not a GT3 race. But the, uh, the AI take it to a whole other level. I'm here mate, I'm on your outside. <laughs> Jesus. Alright, let's actually talk about the game again a little bit. I keep trying. <laughs> but uh, every time I either spin out on my own accord or uh, get taken out by an AI and I mean this guy's looking mighty dangerous that's the line that is a line get fucked <laughs> uh, I'm actually having a lot of fun genuinely this is gonna be one of those really good force feedback and like experience sims um, or games however you want to preface it sim game whatever I, w I like just oh. <laughs> if this would be the sim that I'd use to uh, jump in and have some fun I mean do 20 laps around here against AI equally matched to me I mean, this is on 100 I could probably put them on like 105 110 and we'll be about on, on par with pace still want to turn the aggression down uh, <laughs> they are dangerous very dangerous. But yeah, this isn't, for me, this is a fun one. This is a fun. It's still a sim, but it's fun. Whereas iRacing is fun, but it's more serious, if that makes sense. I don't know if that's if that's a good thing. Obviously, I haven't, I don't really, other than iRacing, I'm not a multiplayer person. Obviously, iRacing is designed to be multiplayer, and uh, that's kind of how I... I see it, whereas AMS, I, in my opinion, obviously I could be completely wrong, this is a single player, AI, have fun kind of sim. Again, I don't do a lot of uh, multiplayer outside of outside of iRacing. But again, the realm of subjectivity and opinions, quite dangerous for reviews you should always watch about 10 or 20 <laughs> oh shit <laughs> ultra dive bomb you want to hit me i'll hit you okay <laughs> the car fell on me <laughs> the car fell on me <laughs> Obviously, you're not seeing the whole of these races at the moment. Uh, this boring would be way too. This boring would be way too video. Yes, this video would be way too boring. Uh, you're seeing some of the highlights. Um, <laughs> because uh, eventually, I will finish a three-lap race. I mean, it was five laps, but it just took too long. And I'd get to like the second to last lap and something would happen. So we're doing three laps now. See if we can uh, actually finish it. But I'm not that much like usually with stuff like this where you're recording a video. I don't know if you guys record videos, but uh, I record videos. I don't know if you know that. Um, I quite thought I had my door open then. That was weird. Uh, <laughs> I quite like... Um, just kind of doing it in one run. I don't like doing it in multiple different takes. Because um, you don't know what you've said or what you've done. Which is, which is more of like a personal thing. And a, a brain thing that I can't quite keep up with. But um, I'm not 
I'm not actually annoyed about going back and restarting and trying this again and again and again. It's, it's still a lot of fun to just drive, which makes the recording process a lot easier. Also makes the videos longer. Which is either a good thing or a bad thing. I'll let you be the judge of that. I was going to say the decider, but my brain called you a dudge. Ultimate dive bomb. Hey, if the AI are going to battle with me, I'm going to push them off the road. I mean, they have been attacking me like crazy. Let's go up on the inside. Where are we now? P20? Oh, this is... You know what's going to happen now. I'm going to royally cock this up. I was going to say, a top 20 finish is going to be perfect for me. After all this, uh, <laughs> I think I'm on like take eight, take take nine. Well, I'm alive. So there's that. Don't do that. Oh, and I've just been touched, touched, tapped. <laughs> you can't see it because obviously I'm using an ultra wide and I only show a 16x9 view but I saw him in my left and instead of, I don't know, keeping his line around the outside he just went into me <laughs> good old AI I'll be honest, I'm getting quite used to the uh, spongy feel because you still get to modulate the the lighter inputs but then you can still slam on it for the heavier inputs and still modulate that as well. Oh, there's another car on its side. Don't land on me! That was some Fast and Furious shit right there. <laughs> okay. Okay. Up into P15 now, if I can hold this up guy off. Oof. <laughs> Sorry, didn't realise you're there. Sorry, didn't realise you're there. Oh no, what a shame. <laughs> oh shit. Yep, deserve that. Well I mean you did crash into me, so. Now, last lap, is a top 10 achievable? Probably not, but let's give it a go. <laughs> Definitely getting the lock-up sounds. <laughs> but I'm feeling it in the pedal, which is a lot, lot nicer. Probably get myself through there a lot quicker. So used to being behind another car that uh, just a bit weak through that. What I'm hoping now is that there's a pile up on the exit of the uh, chicane, <laughs> and we uh, and we just slip through. I mean, it's not totally out of the realm of possibility. Either that or I'll be the pilot. But actually finishing a three lap race. <laughs> Finally. He says spinning around the last corner. Actually finishing a five lap race. Oh, three lap race even. Actually finished. That's handy. 
Oh. Okay. I don't know why I, I... It's not that I stopped playing, I just never actually played it. I mean, this game. Um, I'm not sure why I did that. Maybe because it took me about an hour to set the controls up to get it to actually work. Could have been that, but... That... That was a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Like, genuinely a lot of fun. Even the 17 retakes and restarts and everything. Right, so that was AMS2. Uh, a lot of fun. Not going to be what I would use for um, like proper everyday racing. Uh, that would be a, a still wide eye racing for me. But if I want to jump in and have some fun, I mean, AMS2 is, is a lot of fun. Um, Ultimate Police, obviously, is what I'm saying here. There's not really a lot I can add to to, to that. I I enjoy the game. Uh, it's fun. It's got a nice selection of uh, cars and tracks. Enough to make it worth it, I reckon. Uh, handling's pretty good. Force feedback is fantastic. The sound's pretty good. Yeah, it's all it, all around. It's a good sim. I mean, I I don't want to try the um, like I said earlier. I don't really want to try the online. Um, I think iRacing is where I'll stick with online racing. Um, you, some of you might convince me in the comments. Um, let me know if I'm making a mistake, and I'll, I'll, I'll give it a go. But uh, for now, I'm going to stick with iRacing. But yeah, if you like this video, give it a like. If you really like, subscribe, play with the notification bell to be notified whenever you whenever you upload a video. Whenever I upload a video, um, leave a comment uh, telling me what you think of this video or other videos. Um, if you don't like this video, dislike it. I'm going to tell you to do a bunch of stuff now. This is it. Just do everything. Press all the buttons. <laughs> but yes, that was a video from me. You've watched it. <laughs> all right. Cheers, guys.